Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Let's hop right in to this week's video. I'm using several packs of these canning snap lids and I'm using a combination of the gold and the silver for this first DIY and all I'm doing is laying them out face down in my desired shape before gluing them together. I'm using these craft sticks to combine all the lids together. I'm using this black marker to shade in the center and also the sides of my craft sticks so the bright colors don't show through the back. I'm decorating with these circle mirror tiles that I purchased from Amazon a while back. If you are interested, the link will be down below in my description box. I'm loving how this turned out. It looks very modern. Let me know down in the comments if you would recreate this. So now that I got my desired shape and everything is all glued together, it's time to decorate and all I'm doing is taking the small circle mirror tiles, gluing them directly in the center of the lids. I have two different sizes of these pearls that I purchased from the Dollar Tree a while back and I'm starting off by using the smaller ones first. I'm using the bigger pearls for these four lids at the top. Next, I'm using this sheer ribbon that I purchased from Dollar Tree a while back also, and I'm just making a bow. I'm just gluing one end to the other end for all my pieces. Now I'm creating the bottom piece to complete the look. Thank you. 
These lips were a part of some old earrings that I had and all I did was glued them together and these will be used for the top of my project. Once this is secured, I'm going to clean my mirrors and then add my bow and show y'all the finished look. How adorable is this perfume bottle? Comment below and let me know what y'all think. On to project number three. This is just a foam board that I cut out from last week's project and I'm using this premium black acrylic paint that I purchased from Dollar Tree to fully cover it. To decorate, I'm placing a lid in the center and then I'm going to place more around it. I don't know if y'all can tell, but when painting these foam boards, the foam boards will not lay as flat as it did before you painted it. So once I'm done with my project, I will lay something heavy on it to flatten it out. I'm covering all the open spaces with these mirror tiles. This project turned out fabulous as well. Comment below what was your favorite project for this week. 